Hi everyone! September's astrology is going to be intense. Sure, there are a few bright spots and something to look forward to for everyone, but September is an eclipse month and these eclipses are very stressed out. You're going to want to stay tuned. What happens first is on the first of the month, we have a solar eclipse in Virgo. Now this solar eclipse in Virgo is going to call absolute attention to you focusing on getting something right. You're going to have to do everything in your power to pay attention to every single detail and execute your new plan as well as you possibly can. But I'm going to tell you folks, there will be an obstacle at every turn. This eclipse is opposing Neptune and it's squaring off to Mars and Saturn. So there's stress and tension everywhere. It's true, a solar eclipse can be a powerful new beginning in your life, but this one is filled with obstacles. So you're going to have to fight your way to this new beginning. And the key is to remember that in Virgo, we are seeking perfection. We are seeking getting something right. So there is a strong indication that at the beginning of this plan, you think you're getting something right, but you're not. And you're running into problems until you fix this plan. Remember also that at the beginning of the month, Mercury is retrograde in Virgo. So it's going to be extra, extra important for you to take things slowly and execute that plan as mindfully as possible. Wonderful news in September happens on the 9th. This is when Jupiter, the planet of expansion and abundance, changes signs and moves into Libra for the first time in 12 years. Jupiter will remain in Libra until October 10th of the following year, and you can expect major blessings and opportunities for everyone connected to relationship, connected to partnership, connected to what is fair and just. And I am very excited about Jupiter moving into Libra. There'll be more about that in your specific signs forecast. The stress is back on September 16th when we have a lunar eclipse in Pisces. Now this is going to be a confusing, stressful, and angry eclipse. This eclipse is squaring off to Mars and Mars is not happy. So that means that you might be overly emotional and apt to make decisions or do something reactive, out of emotions, out of anger, instead of logical. There's really not much logic to Pisces. Pisces is all about the imagination and spirituality and what's unseen. And it's more about what you're feeling and squaring off to Mars. That's going to trigger some anger issues for people. So just try to stay calm. By the end of the month, things get better and calmer for everyone. Mercury will turn direct after having been retrograde since August 30th. He turns direct on September 22nd in Virgo. And by the end of the month, the eclipse tension will begin to lift away and Mercury will begin to regulate his orbit, allowing all of us to think clearly and focus on what's important once again. Now that you understand what September is bringing for you all in general, be sure to watch your sign's specific monthly September forecast right here at tarot.com.